G'day Western Australia, I'm Coram Ellis from Audiocom. Today I want to tell you about Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. It's the latest in a long line of different interfaces for your car to keep you safer and more legal when traveling on the road and give you more convenience and more access to your multimedia and your communications. Now recent legal changes for phone operation road rules in Western Australia means that if you are caught holding or using your handset while driving, you will get major penalties costing you both money and points. So what you want to upgrade to is an Apple CarPlay or Android Auto interface in your car, which lets you operate all of your multimedia and communications on your phone without physically touching your phone. Everything is managed via voice and all of the interface is brought through onto your dash, onto your new multimedia interface, which is what I'd like to show you here today. We keep a few different versions of these in stock, in store, so you can come on down to the stores and have a bit of a look and a play and see how these are gonna help you out. What we've got here connected behind me is a Sony 9-inch multimedia system. This is one of our most popular units. It fits into a lot of different cars. Uh, it's really good value and it's going to give you the best bang for buck. We've got an Apple iPhone connected to it at the moment, so it's running in Apple CarPlay mode. And you'll see that your Apple CarPlay interface brings all of your phone functions up on the screen for you to operate from the screen. Now, you can be touching and operating the screen in the car without breaching any of the road rules but you cannot be touching and operating the handset. So when docked and connected like this, you're fully connected to the screen uh, and you can manage your music and other multimedia sources. You can access Spotify interface directly from the touch screen. You've got access to all your messages. It will read messages out to you and you can reply via voice. You've got access to your maps, Apple Maps, Google Maps, Waze. All of these are available for free and there's lots of different map interfaces you can purchase online as well if you would like something more specific. Lots and lots of options there. Let's zoom in a little bit closer and see how this interface looks when your phone is connected. This is our Apple CarPlay interface. So we've got the phone connected as I showed you before in the wide angle and this is the interface that you'll then experience on the dash of your car. So you've got your maps on one side, multimedia on the other side. All of this is customizable by the way, you can change things around. Uh, so you can access your Spotify and you've got your full Spotify interface completely available all here on the touch screen. Uh, you've got all your call logs and features, you've got messages available. There's lots of other apps that are available to download and have accessible on the dash as well. Things like um, ebooks and podcasts are all accessible and navigatable from the interface here. Like I said before, you could be touching this at any time, you're not breaching any road rules. But if you touch your handset, you can get fined. So this interface is definitely the thing you want to upgrade to, to keep your, yourself as legal and as safe and as productive as possible on the road. The Android Auto version of this is very, very similar. The interface brings up the same sort of apps and gives you the same sort of touch and voice control without touching the handset. So whether you're Apple or Android, we have a solution for you. Now there's lots of different types of units out there on the market. You'll see six and a half inch and seven inch ones up here, uh, which fit in the dash with a more of a flush look or the more modern interface and the more popular one definitely lately is the nine inch interface. These screens will sit out and up on the dash a little with what we call a floating style display. Now these sorts of units, is, they're a bit more on par with new car design styling. You'll see a lot of new cars now have the floating style dash display. Uh, so it gives you a chance to modernize the dash a little bit, keep things looking a little bit fresher. But most importantly, the big screen will give you a better interface to operate this sort of, your Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Because a lot of new cars come out with very big screens now, 8, 9, 11, even up to 21 inch screens. The Apple CarPlay software and the Android Auto software is being optimized for large screen operation. So if you try and cram all those features down on a smaller 7 inch screen, it gets a little crowded. That's why it's definitely a better choice to go a 9 inch screen now. You're more future proof, you'll have a better multimedia interface as these platforms develop organically in the future. As they will because your phone automatically upgrades and downloads new versions of this as they come along from Apple and from Android. 
So in summary, the Apple CarPlay and Android Auto interface is definitely the number one way to go to when you upgrade your multimedia interface in the car. It's going to keep you more legal, more productive, safer. You'll have a better user experience when driving and access to more multimedia messaging and navigation, all via voice. It keeps you better connected and safer on the road. Come and see us at Audiocom stores all around Perth. We've got lots of different stuff on display so we can show you how these interfaces work. Pick out the best solution for your car, build up a package and book you for installation. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below and we'll come at you soon with more tips and tricks on how to stay better connected and safer on the road.